what initially drew me to the to the role to the show was the creative team that was already assembled before I before I got on board. When I got on board, I hadn't read a script. I didn't know exactly what the story was, but I knew it was a noir, a, a neo noir. I knew it was a detective story, and and but I didn't know the ins and outs of it. What I did know, I knew that Colin was attached as executive producer and as as the lead actor. And I knew that the pilot would be directed by Fernando Mireles. And just those two, you know, just, just those two people being attached from the beginning made me feel like this was going to be a project that had great significance. I think that Colin's work has spanned, you know, every single genre possible. And I, Fernando has created... A, some of the most iconic cinema that we have. So I felt like together this would be a project that would be unlike anything else. The character of Ruby was pitched to me as Ruby is to Sugar what M is to James Bond. And I feel like that was my way into this character because from growing up and seeing that dynamic, uh, that you know, the James Bond M dynamic, you realize that it's a relationship that constantly is evolving. You know, the power shifts and the relationship there is uh, great trust there, but also there's sort of a, there can sometimes be this sort of parent-child element, but that, that also shifts. So it was really exciting to me that to have a way into the character. And then I think you see, as the, as the episodes develop, you see their relationship changing, you see it unfolding in a way that is very typical of a classic noir. You know, you start with one thing and it evolves into something else because I think if you are familiar with that genre of film the I would say the defining element of it is that things aren't as they seem and people aren't as they seem so does your character have any standout episodes that you're excited about and if so can you drop us some some teasers about <laughs> what we can expect from Ruby's development well I'm honestly most excited for fans, there's no particular episode that I'm excited for. I mean, ex I'm excited for the entire series, but I think what makes me most excited is that the reason why there isn't one that I can tell you, because I feel like the show is paced in such a specific way that the audience is, their journey is almost mirroring John Sugar's journey. You know, this is very much a, a show where truths and lies are slowly uncovered but there is great tension throughout. And I think as an audience member, you get so much joy from being part of that detective process. You're, you are, you become kind of a sleuth and every episode, you're just sort of given a little bit more information and you piece this show together. And I think that's also what's really brilliant about the way the show will be released. The first, you get the first two episodes, so you're in, but then you have to wait each week. So it allows you this time for, your, for the cogs to keep turning, for you to be putting this, the pieces of the puzzle together. How will your social media be impacted activity-wise? Are you gonna be going onto social media, reading hashtags related to the show, reading any blog recaps to see what viewers think of the new series? and what they have to say about your performance. I, in general, do not read uh, what people have to say about my performance. Or for me, I think, I love hearing what people are thinking about the show. I love seeing, because I do think there's a whole culture of internet detectives. I love that aspect. I think the, the that's the job of the art. The art is, it's not about me personally, it's about the show. So. That's what I'm really excited about, is, is all the internet theories. When it comes to my own performance, I'm less involved in that. I don't think that's my, that's not my job. My job is to create something, put it out, hope it is received, and you know, you, the job of the audience member is to receive it, interpret it, and you know, take what they can from it.